How's it going, boys? So today we're playing Happy Ever After. Right. Oh god, this is probably the most correct name for a deck I have ever created. So, quick rundown of Happy Ever After. It's impossible. It's an impossible win condition. Where is it? Oh, it's in the sideboard, right? So, it's an impossible win condition. If you use creatures with it, chances are you're 100% killing your opponent before this ever happens. If you're not using creatures and using your control deck, chances are the moment the enemy understands that you need to pretty much just get your whole sideboard out of the, out of the sideboard before winning, makes them surrender. I have no idea. Just does Happy Ever After have a cutesy animation if we win? I, I don't know. Everyone just surrenders at the moment they understand that this is gonna take forever. Because the bare minimum of time to win with this deck, and keep in mind by win I mean uh, waiting until the enemy surrenders, is around 50, 15 minute-ish. <laughs> oh yes! Uh, this is horrible. So let me, yeah, probably mo some of you who have watched me for a longer time already know what a deck that looks like this or this this sort entices. So, two Fairy of Wishes, three Assassin's Trophies, four Growth Spirals, four Prison Realms, four Gifts of Paradiso, three Chemist's Insights, uh, three Drown in Dreams, three, three Ley Lines of Anticipation, uh, four Wilderness Reclamations, four Kai's Rats, two Candidates, the Returning Kings, and in the sideboard, two Golden Eggs, one Sorcerer's Spyglass, two Happy Ever Afters, three Cleanse the Mind, two Kai's uh, Oath of Kai, one Drown in Dreams, two Time Wipes, thousand, two Thousand Year Storms. Yeah, I know. Woohoo, this is gonna be something. So the fastest way to uh, play this deck is get a Fae of Fishes. And start recycling, cleanse the mine, and the extra drown in dreams. And that is going to be the fastest absolute way of actually making this deck work. And by work, I mean, I honestly don't know. Maybe I'm too stupid to actually understand the win condition, and I just don't know yet that it works. Because again, no one, absolutely almost no one, wants to go through with this. Also, this deck doubles down as a mill deck, a land destruction deck, and pretty much everything, anything, and everything else you've ever wished it was. Oh, this is far too greedy, sadly. This is far not better, but hey, that's just life. Okay, don't need two chemists insides at the start, so boom. Okay, could have been a better starting hand, but hey, that's fine. Okay, that's not fine. Okay, that's great. Not fine, boys. Not f not fine. Put the plus one one count on a, on a knight you control. Oh, great! Look at that champion. You know what this is? It's annoyance. Also, we didn't hit a land drop, so that's even worse. Well, now we need to kill this sadly instantly. There's no other way. Otherwise, he gets too much value out of it. And also, vulnerable knight now will die. Invade. Oh, yeah, of course it's black also. What, what else would be a knight deck? Oh, yeah, sure. Yeah, play play lands on curve. Yeah, you, you go ahead and play lands on curve, why don't you? Look at me. I'm not even gonna... Oh, I got a land. Woo, we win. Okay, so we put... Uh, most of the time we put Gift of Paradisio on green slash blue lands because then you can't cast otherwise Kai's Wrath. Of course you get that, you you sick, twisted, perverted fuck. Of course you do. Why wouldn't you? And now you deal three billion damages. Yeah, that's just that's just honestly peachy. Well, at least we have something to stop stop the onslaught a little bit. But yeah, he can create a knight now. He can create a three three per turn. Uh, you know what that sounds like? Not fun. Not fun at all. Okay, we got this, which is not exactly bad. Okay, so at least we're gonna Chemist's Insights, and technically we don't die for an extended period of time, hopefully. And that... Okay, so there's this one... I'm actually contemplating going back to 23 lands per deck, because the new update literally almost makes it like it's a 50-50 chance to gain a land, which is not fun. Not fun at all. 
Okay, if I do that, I can't do anything, so it's useless to do that. Let's do this. More Kai's rats on one hand, that does give me a time, uh, a, a, some time to do my shenanigans. Boom. But I need to kill this, otherwise he just continues to making knights, and that's gonna make me extremely, extremely sad about life in general. More sad than average, boys. More sad than average. You see what I mean? It looks like there's a 50% land draw, which is kind of really annoying. One in three draws is a land is fine, but it honestly, considering I'm playing this deck, I actually, Jesus Christ, stop. Okay, considering I am playing so much of these decks, at least he can't actually, like, do anything too much now. But yeah, considering I'm playing decks like this, God, why can't this just Prison Realm something really, really good? Well, uh, hopefully, hopefully we find Drown in Dreams and then it's gonna be fine. Because then we can find more Drown in Dreams and then we can find more Drown... <laughs> we can find so many Drown in Dreams. And it's gonna be amazing, because reasons. Yes, yes, you created the knight. Congratulations. You know what? Prison Realm. But yeah, as you can see, you can pretty much see that it's almost 50% draw rate for lands if you have a 60 card deck. Thank, thank you, Jesus. You are my best homie, not gonna lie. Finally, Assassin's Trophy has been acquired. Okay, he does that. That does not exactly do too much. Three life left. Chances are he can't really buff it, but can I actually take the risk? I don't want to take the risk. That's like the point. Also, he could... Yeah, see what I mean? Another land. So the next draw is not gonna be a land. Okay, I kill this instantaneously because honestly we can't wait. Also, I need to kill this because otherwise he just resummons all his dumb knights and then those dumb knights do dumb knights stuff and not a fun time to be alive. So yeah. Wait, is it the land draw or is it not the land draw? Menace, 3 damage. No. Okay, that's actually okay. We can actually save Kaiser. I just need a Drown in Dreams game. Well now, okay, so this scry is useless because it's not gonna be a land. See what I mean? You see what I mean? That's how it goes. It's absolutely abysmally questionable how the hell Wizards thought that getting a land every second draw for the first half of the game is a reasonable idea. Because it, it, it just flat out seems... Oh, Jesus, guys. That's, that's a little bit too much, not gonna lie, game. Wait, am I dead? No. Can't let things attack though, which is a little bit annoying, but hey, we live in annoying time. So I need to actually do that or I die. Or I could just throw it of Kai and pretend that it's okay. Uh, let's see, if we do that, we can't do that. The best we can do is this, and everything dies. He has sick. Wait, well, why are you not passing? Do you have actually something that stops me from do doing manly things? Is there a knight with haste? I don't think there's a knight with haste. There's no knight with haste, right? And also, a small thing I have also noticed is the absurd amount of times I get the Kai's Rats at this first, uh, first part of the deck. And it's been pretty rare that I actually get bricked somehow. So, there you have it, boys. There you absolutely 100% oh have so. Okay, yes, we expected this, but I will be able to kill it. Okay, now that's really disgusting. But that's actually exactly what I almost wanted. I'm still dead if I don't kill it, so it's not the best situation ever. Uh, okay, let's see. None of this actually works, but this does work phenomenally well. Actually, wait. Black, black, not black, damn it. Okay, plan two. Wait, is there, a pl is there anything that even remotely looks like a plan two here? Ah, uh, well, plan two is gonna be wishful thinking, I think. Seems like it. Could have probably anticipated the fact that that's a son of a bitch! Oh, god damn it! We were so close to actually making this guy cry. Don't attack. Please don't attack. Attacking is dumb. 
Don't attack. Don't attack. Don't you dare attack. Ah, oh, that's a lot of unluck that we had, you know, so little drop over at the start. Don't Come on, don't attack. Just down, down. Oh, oh, you son of a bitch. Ugh, oh, god damn it. Why can't it be every third land is a t- uh, Why can't it every be, uh, be every third draw is a land and then at the mid of the deck you kind of get a little bit of more two draws in the, of lands in a row. That would be such an easier way to actually balance. Because you can- you must understand by this point that Wizard's way of uh, sorting lands in the deck is completely not RNG at this point. It is completely the furthest away from RNG it ever could be. But at least the hands are playable. But then again, if you get cugged by, uh, cugged by, uh, by 50% lands, it does feel a little bit sticky and icky. And that's not what we want. But it's fine. Okay, so looks like this is gonna be a perfect setup for well living conditions. As long as he doesn't get rid of my wilderness reclamation on a curve thought erasure. Well it looks looks like that's not happening. Okay. Okay, so do this so we can chemist's insights on curve. Well, that did not happen. And he just surrenders instantaneously because our uh, opening is just too goddamn powerful. That's also good. God, that game! So unlucky! I should have actually manually tapped the lands. I thought that we were gonna get an Assassin's Trophy and we were gonna be able to call it a day, but we didn't get an Assassin's Trophy. Like, how many cards that was? 30 cards, look at 7. Chance is not getting an Assassin's Trophy or anything that actually heals you or does something like that. Uh, pretty much non-existent, honestly. So yeah, that was pretty much not what I uh, wanted from life. But then again, it rarely is. Also, going second is a little bit... Anno oh god, that's an aggro deck. Oh god, that's a sacrifice aggro deck. Sacrifice aggro decks are one of the fastest decks known to humanity, so there is a... You can actually use this as a... To drop because it's gonna save lives essentially. Oh no, he's just using that, I guess. Yeah, whatever. Okay, since it's ha since this has four HP, it's gonna save me at least three HP in the long run, or he can't attack with this because of all reasons. Okay, so that's not actually that. Yes, he can't do anything. What a red deck, absolute champion. Okay, put it on that. You know, if you put, if you love something, put the ring on it. Like, you know, Temple of Mystery. It, it's actually two hands clasping, if anyone does not know yet. So there you have it. The, the perfect metaphor for... I'll actually know what at this point. But it's absolutely perfect, mark my words. Well, so far it looks like it's gonna be a win. Oh my god, is that a runaway Steamkin? You absolutely disgusting creature. Ah, you know, it's honestly fine. Okay, can we actually play this? Yes, we can. So, first uh, order of business, get, get rid of that disgusting creature. We're not gonna- oh yes! Second order of business, tap this for life, use chemist's insight. To get a little bit more insight and do not attack again. Ah, man, when the plan comes together. I'm betting this guy runs like 18 lands or something like that. <gasps> Honestly, if he wins from this point, I'm gonna just call straight out Hux or Luck. Because, you know, it's, it's pretty impossible, not gonna lie. Oof, that's actually one of the things we want. Okay, so let's see, more Drowning Dreams, more of these bad boys, yep, that's exactly what I was looking for. Not really, but hey, that's fine. Okay, so if he drops a Chandra, I can kill the Chandra, the Chandra will be, that's not the Chandra I honestly expected, but hey. Well, it's not the Chandra I expected, it's, it's the, we have the perfect solution for it. Magic. A competitive game played by millions. 
and by Wizards of the Coast statistics, at least 50% suckling delicious women. Judging by my channel, I can definitely tell you that's at best like uh, 1.5%, but I'm, I'm sure Wizards is, would never lie to us. So yeah, there, there, there's that. Okay, what do I do now? Uh, I can't cast this, so might as well cast it. Need to get this out, because that's my last fate, so whatever. God, that first game! So a little bit a lot unlucky! Okay... Am I gonna kill the dragon? Nah, I'm probably gonna... Well, honestly, I just don't want to screw all around later on with it, so I'm gonna do this. Uh, we're gonna use this thing, so it's it's a little bit better, arguably. No one knows at this point. Could be Hux, could be Lies, could be something something. Also, it does seem like Prison Realm is not gonna be too useful, because drawing a little bit more... Ca yeah, that's the stuff. That's the stuff. Yeah, currently looks like it's not mixed to fifth. Well, it's almost like that. No, actually, it's a lot. No, it's not. That's fine, but this guy's also not, so it's definitely fine. Okay. So, well, we found everything that we wished to find. <clears throat> Wait, if we do it like this. Okay, game. First, let's do it. No. Okay. I understand this is extremely, extremely difficult game, but it really should not be that difficult to tap lands in the correct order of things and MacGuffins. So, yeah. It, it really should not be. So, play lines of anticipation, and that's pretty much almost all she wrote. Now we can do this. We hopefully find more Drown in the Kaya's Wrath, and nothing else is honestly useful here except that card. Okay, we can also fay of wishes a little bit later, so there's still a chance for that Leia's dance. Uh, the deck's pretty healthy still. Hello there. You're a Chandra. I should spyglass you because I really dislike Chandras against me. Okay, I actually have no idea does spyglass do anything against planeswalkers. It's a, it, it's a pretty iffy situation, not gonna lie. So yeah, taking one perpetual damage, so this guy's definitely not gonna give up. Drew a land, as literally everyone expected. Drew one more land, as literally no one expected. I'm gonna do this because we wanna draw stuff. And drew a land. Okay, see, see, I'm, I'm, I'm seeing some stuff here, boys, not gonna lie. Okay, hopefully he tries to get rid of this face somehow. So I can actually save it. Oh my god, please stop. Please stop. Okay, so we have still more face, so it's honestly fine. Okay, so wh what are we getting? A sorcerer's spyglass to pretend that we know what we're doing, or the last drown in dreams, because that is, that's actually useful. Eh, that's all I'm gonna say about this situation, boys. God, I need that, I need that king guy. I really, really need that king guy. He literally solves every such. Might as well play it, honestly. Might as well play it. Okay, so currently taking two deeps. Not not the greatest. More lands. Well, that's kind of expected. Do this. Uh, You know what? I'm going to take this. And then I'm going to take probably Growth Spiral. Not like anything else is going to be remotely useful. Okay, that's great. Let's see. We're scrying, so there's double synergy right there. Can we scry something good? It's a land. No, game stop. I know you really, really think I like lands or something, but honestly, I kind of don't at this point anymore. You can give all the lands to enemy Kun right there. Wait, is first scrying? Yes, first scrying is gonna be better. Okay, that's useless. I'm actually gonna keep that because at this moment I'm just... Goddamn paranoid. Okay, found the land. Actually, perfect. I'll, I, I exact. I wanted the land. Now we can actually use chemists inside without significant losses to our morality. Good. Great. Not gonna lie. 
Come on, enemy, you're a champion. I, I know you can do it. Of course you do that. Okay, stop with the goddamn planeswalkers! Seriously! It's, it's, it's about time to stop. Okay, let's see. Even if I find a wilderness reclamation, do I actually keep it? Uh, it's, yeah! Okay, there's a chance we're gonna hit the King of Kings soon, plus we have so much draw currently saved up in our Vazua. So it's not gonna be exactly bad. We have... We have two more chemists... Well, actually, one more chemists inside, but we have three more somethings. So yeah, god, this guy is trying to burn us so badly. Insane. Okay, well, we knew that that's gonna happen. So we, we do this, right? Not gonna scry first. Should have scryed first. Okay. So, what can we actually pull out of the side? I don't even remember what's in my side deck. Actually, I do. A golden egg. Actually, no, the golden egg is not gonna be that. I'd fuck it at this point, honestly. Okay. Jesus Christ, come on, game. Just need to give me a lot of cards that draw cards. And, you know, I'm, I'm really happy about life. Okay, do this. Okay. What's useful from all this crap? Is it the egg or is it happy ever after? Maybe it's happy ever after because I said so. Okay. First of all, let's cry because that makes the most amount of sense. Absolutely not and absolutely not. Uh, at this point, honestly, I'm a bit also feeling that currently with the new patch and way Wizards is doing stuff, it's not maybe the best... Uh -huh. That's at least something that does stuff. I can't really complain too much about it, but, you know, I, okay, I can complain a lot about it. Should have probably scribed first, not gonna lie. Kai's Rat is not gonna be useful now, is it? Okay. How are we not hitting any card that draws things? Hitting a card that draws things or hitting a... Wait, what's the actual chance? Uh, six... 25 chance. We have a 25 chance to hit what we want. If we don't hit something... Actually, we're gonna draw one more time, so it's... Roughly a 37.5% chance to actually get the king, or get something that does something. I'm gonna just scry an extra turn, because if we find it, it's actually gonna be... F oh, of course not. Oof. Well, now it's even a bigger chance, honestly, so hey, there we go. We can protect with the face, so it doesn't matter. We're gonna survive one turn probably more no matter what, so please just don't give me a land. Okay, more phase. Well, honestly, that's not even that bad. Phase are useful. Okay, too bad I can't put the king in the sideboard. So what are we gonna do? Hmm, maybe we want the golden egg? Nah, happy ever after seems a little bit better. Oh, boys. Well, two Wilderness Reclamations, I can easily scry. Like, the chances couldn't... Okay, so we have drawn at least... It's a 50%... It's more than a 50% chance currently to draw the card that we need. With the cum accumulated percentile, it, it is something like above 50% chance, or 51 at the bare minimum. See? See? Exactly the two cards that we needed, lads. Exactly! Actually, I should have swapped them around, but at this moment, who cares? We, we did it! Ah, after all the hardships, after a bright night, comes a brighter day. True words, true words, boys, and now we can actually, okay. Ah, oh, finally. God damn it, that took forever. Let's take a king. Actually, do we want Assassin's Trophy, or do we just want one more king? Not even sure at this moment. Probably Assassin's Trophy, because I don't want to deal with that crap. Okay. So, just gonna instantaneously deal with that. Yeah, and then gonna drop the king. And there's nothing he can do to kill the king, right? 
Well, we don't need exactly need to use the king instantaneously, and plus one one counters are not exactly the most hard uh, hard nudges thing to acquire. So there we have it. The king has been finally dropped. Whoop de do. God, only took us to get to a fifty percent uh, accumulative chance to draw the right card. Only that much, boys. Which is actually being goddamn insanely stupid. But hey, okay, so what does he do now? I can give myself life and, you know, further improve, improve the torture. Or we can, you know, not do that and do some other shenanigans. God, this guy has a lot of Chandras. Is this a Chandra deck? By the way, I kind of resurrected the Chandra only Chandra deck to the new format. It's pretty nice. It's pretty nice. We might, we might play it. Tomorrow or whenever. So yeah, let's see what he does. What can he actually get from the graveyard? Ah, oh, he can get that shit. Ah, oh, he can actually kill my king. Yes, he's going for the king, king kill. Okay, that's a problem. Because we don't have green lands. Because... Tap, tapping Gifts of Paradisio is, like, the game's biggest purpose in life. Great stuff. He, c he can easily spend it. Actually, no, maybe he fucks up, right? Now there's no way he fucks up. Okay, sad, but whatever. Wait, ta oh, targeted player. For a moment there I thought that, hey, maybe it's gonna be good in the hood, but it's not. What? Okay, now I'm just gonna make you waste more things. He's actually gonna not survive, but... Okay, we, we drew a land. Okay, that means we're scrying with Castle Ventress before the thing happens. We can still so easily get exactly what we need to succeed in this life. Wait, did he... Oh, he did the plus thing. Okay. Uh, boom, boom, boom. Yes, yes, yes. That's that's fine. No one cares. Scrying. Oh, at least we found this thing. Good, good draw. Okay, now we can get something even more ridiculous from the sideboard. Ah, oh, yes. Wait. I might as well drop this. No, no, no. Let's not drop that. Wait. What? Oh, yes. It's fine. It's fine. Oh god, god damn it, boys! God damn it, boys! You, you you can't even imagine, by the way, how much pleasure and unadulterated pain I am currently feeling, because it's a lot. It's a lot. Wait, how much do we actually need until winning? Colors among permanents. You oh, we could have won already, probably long ago. Okay, do this, do that. Perfect, absolutely flawless. Okay, uh, let's see, do this, do that, absolutely flawless. Okay, do we want to get rid of the Chandra, or do we want to get rid of, we want to get rid of this Chandra, because it's a little bit more annoying. Okay, so, and, let's see, what's our next move? Well, we don't exactly need to do anything. Uh, we can just get rid of the lands to spite the game because it just gives us too many lands. Also, question is, what the hell am I supposed to... Ah, uh, well, you know, I can get rid of two lands now and draw two more phase. Kill me now, please. Let, let, let this end. We're almost at peak capacity, boys. Almost at goddamn peak capacity. Okay, so everything dies. We take one damage. That's gonna be a little bit more damage. It's fine. We we can still we can still get a Kingu out. So you know it's it's one hundred percent fine. Okay, what do we want? Maybe we want the storm. No, we don't want the storm. We we want this. It's time. It's, it's time to reset, boys. It's flat out time to reset. Wait, do I need to reset? Yeah, all the drowning dreams are there, and all of this is in the exile bin. 
Ah, oh, where is our goddamn stupid king? He's probably down there because more reasons. Okay, at least he's not drawing anything. That's great. I still can play eggs from the sideboard, by the way. Just, just step five. Wait, can we actually win? Tourism, uh, yes, we need to sacrifice that and we actually win. Well, kinda ish. You know, kinda ish. I should have actually cleansed the mind before doing that. Well, that's now useless. Wait. Okay, draw, I guess. That was probably a bad idea. Well, more lands. On the one hand, that's not exactly bad because reasons. On the other hand, it's pretty bad because, well, the same reasons, probably. Okay, so that that's that's it. And we can do this. This does not go back into the graveyard, right? No, it doesn't. Oh! Absolutely flawless. Now we can play this thing. Okay. Something, something. I kind of warned you about this. This being the most long deck ever created by man. And we're trying to win. We're actually, like, trying to win, boys. Actually... Trying to win, as sad as it seems. Okay, there's there's still so many lands left in the deck. What's going on? Why are there so many goddamn lands left in the deck? Okay, more Drown in Dreams. Okay, that means I can just get rid of this Chandra now. Absolutely flawless. Okay, uh, great success. How does this guy not surrender yet? I honestly have absolutely no idea. I honestly don't. Okay, great. More lands. We, we found lands, boys. Exactly what I dreamt about in my nightmares. Finding more lands. Drown in dreams. Gonna find more drown in dreams. And okay, finally we found the king. Okay, Jesus Christ. Now we... <laughs> Now we can give ourselves more HP! Ah, oh, that, that's, that's such a good play! Just gonna give myself more HP! Oh, well, that is one of the win conditions, so you can't really blame me on that. Also, did I not... Nah, actually, I probably did not put that in the deck, but it's fine. Okay, drown in dreams, boys! Okay, so let's see what we want. Uh, none of this is useful except cleanse the mind and assassin. Nah, actually, we can just take two lands. We can take two lands, and now we can play a fey. Could have honestly gotten, you know, what's its face a long time ago, but that's fine. Okay, do that. Can't play the fey because, oh no, we have a blue land. Thank, thankfully, at least that's happening. Okay, boys. Soon, we're gonna win. But I have a feeling that this guy's patience is at an all-time record low. So, uh, honestly, hard to say. Hard to say. Also, we need, like, a bunch of cards in the graveyard. So, yeah. So, we need to get the egg back. And now we need to get the thing. We have almost shuffled our entirety of our, you know, uh, what's it called? Sideboard into our thingamajig uh more 10 out of 10 it uh, yeah well if you have sticked uh, around so long you can slowly uh, slowly tell that i have become a little bit mental how much tedious everything is required of me to play this deck how much literally everything everything is required to play this deck Oh god, please do not make this deck. Actually do, and buy it off of, you know, what's its face, Ether Hub. Oh, you play the land. God, we have already cycled through our thingamajig uh, deck like 50 times now. We have cycled through our deck so many times now, it's not even funny. Oh Jesus, oh well, that's at least an easy sack. Okay, amazing. Ten, 10 out of 10. Dro drop this. This is gonna make things a little bit faster. Because, well, more reasons, I guess. Okay, sack everything. Fine, it's fine. 
How many? How how much do we need? Five uh, colors among permanents. So we need two more casts of Fey, and we actually get our win condition up. Uh, woo woo. Okay, so let's see. We get one storm proc here, so there's a chance that we're gonna get everything nice, cheeky, hunky dory. So we're getting the golden egg because, well, again reasons. No attacks. The golden egg has been acquired, which means chances are we're gonna win now, because we need so little now to actually like make make everything happen. Okay, golden egg is there. Found the land. Not even remotely surprised. Oh, by the way, scrying before the king is actually a little bit better. Well, it doesn't really matter what we scry. We just need two of these and, and it's gonna be fine. Okay. So, target player draws a card. God, we're gonna win, boys. We're actually gonna win. It's insane, but it looks like that we're gonna actually win. Took forever. And honestly, congratulations, enemy Kun, for sitting through this thing. I certainly as hell would not sit through this. Hell, I I would not even watch the video until this point. Timestamp this. Po oh, by the way, yeah, now I cast it two times because reasons. Should have actually done that a lot sooner. But on the on the, obviously not in the right mental state. Okay, that's good. Uh, let's get a sorcerer now. Let's just get an egg. Okay, so play this. We need to sag this egg, by the way. I think that works. Again, not 100% sure at this moment. And then we can Kaius, and I think that's gonna be okay. One more color among permanents. One more color among permanents, boys. Just, just one more color. And we have it. And you know, one more cast of, you know, this guy, Kevin, the King of Kings. Okay? All we need now is a little bit more HP. All we need now is a little bit more HP. And we're gonna see, is there an animation of us doing the most unreasonable win condition currently existing in the game or not? Okay, I'm gonna give myself like a bunch of HP, so if he tries to be a smart ass about it, he can't. Okay, every condition has been met. Good game. <laughs> we did it! We did it! We fucking... God damn it! <sighs> of course, of course. Well, anyway, I guess that's the deck. Like the video. I'm gonna go strangle someone and hopefully not get caught. So, yeah, this was Quizzer Sensen. Thanks for watching. Subscribe if you haven't already. Check out the channel, check out the Discord, check out the Patreon, check out the Ethercom, check out the everything. And have a nice day. Bye bye. Don't make this deck. It's maybe arguably worse than Hyper Cancer. And that's a tall order to fill.